Hey everyone, so I'm not going to be on camera during this video, but it's just going to be a whole overview video of my lipstick collection, lip gloss collection, um, liquid lipsticks, etc. Um, I'm not going to do swatches on all of them, but I'll do it on quite a few, so let's get into it. So this is my lipstick drawer. In this first section, I have two trays that look like... Oh, this if I can get one out the trays just look like this I got them from hot dollar I'm pretty sure and do they have a pattern on the bottom yeah they have that like lacy pattern on the bottom so if you wanted to grab some you know which ones to get so I have two of those in the front and they hold most of my lipsticks like actual lipsticks they do hold all of my lipsticks actually except for a few up the back and then I have this other tray which oh, is just another one of those trays so I have three in total two going this way and one going the other way I then have this little pink container from hot dollar also that just holds all of my lip liners I don't have too many lip liners I need to get more and then up the back I just have this is a little thing that's from Avon and it has every single lipstick that they had one year I don't know which year it was but um, where's this from I think it was maybe a garage sale and it was a deceased estate or something I'm not even 100% sure but some of these are crazy I'll show you a couple of swatches this one's called teak rose it looks like that I'll just do a swatch and show you So that's teak rose there. Ignore all the other mess on my hand, but they're actually pretty decent pigmentation. And this, I want to show you some cool ones though. There's ones that have like shimmer in them. I'll have to find it. Hold on. I just watched a couple more. Look how creamy they are. I don't think it's even doing justice on this camera, but the one on the left is called shit. I just watched it. What was it called? Um, it's called the one on the left is chocolate fling and the one on the right is chocolate frosting but they're so buttery and creamy oh, so good it even looks like something you could use in, as an eyeshadow base in all honesty right up the back I just have a couple of palettes I have the BH Cosmetics 28 color lipstick palette which is actually really good um, who raved about that and it got really popular I'm pretty sure it was Shanexo and then I have my show face lipstick palette which they're pretty pigmented in all honesty let me oh holy shit so I just swatched a couple of those lipsticks and they are crazy this one up in the top left hand corner that's the one on the right and then this one here is the one on the left oh they are so crazy I kind of forgot how good these were now I'm just gonna randomly go through some lipsticks in the front I've got some of the Kate Rimmel lipsticks I've got what's this studio secret so this is a lip balm I'm pretty sure what is it yeah it's like a a priming stick or something what's it actually called universal lip glow I'm just going to swatch it on my arm and see if you can see anything. Nah, I'll show you guys quickly. You can just see how it's made my arm wet there. I guess it's a bit of a sheen, but that's all it did. Oh, a little mini NARS liquid lippy. I've got more lip balms. These are like my little lip balms over here. Some random ones, more lip balms in here. I've got a whole bunch of these Chi Chi ones all through here. Like all these are Chi Chi. And I do have quite a few colored double ups. Um, these are all Maybelline ones. These, like all these stickers. Oh, they're L'Oreal actually. They're the color riche. These are really good quality. I'll just show you a swatch so you know what I mean. Oh, this one is nice. Oh, it's so melted though. Check that out. That's intense. <laughs> That's beautiful. I forgot how nice this was. That's it down the bottom it looks so different on my phone but like it looks completely different me looking at it with my eyes <laughs> oh, I can't get over that pink one on my arm that is intense that is a perfect Barbie color right there I've then got a whole bunch of essence lipsticks these are really good quality too uh, I've not even opened this are you joking 
Look, there's still sticky tape on it. I haven't opened it. Okay, let's get one that's open so I can swatch it and show you how good they are. This one's called Dare to be Nude, number five. This is such a nice nude. That's just it there on the right next to the one we just swatched before. Oh, it's so pretty. Uh, this is a Chanel lipstick, the only Chanel lipstick that I have. <laughs> it's called, it's number 28. It's a Rouge Coco one in Byzantine. Bison, I'll show you what it looks like. It's just like a dark berry burgundy kind of color and it says Chanel on it. <laughs> it's so nice. This is MAC Velvet Teddy that's still in the box. Because Velvet Teddy, I don't know, it's just a really weird shade for my skin tone. It looks beautiful on lighter shades, but on dark skin tones, it's just, it does not look anywhere near as nice. So I'll show you what it looks like. Oh, that's what it looks like in the tube. I'm losing light so quickly, sorry about that. So that's it on my hand there. It's pretty similar to that one actually. That could be a pretty good dupe, that one there. But this is Velvet Teddy on the left. I have hardly any storage on my phone, so I'm going to have to get through the rest of this super quickly. I just want to talk about my liquid lipsticks quickly. I've got mostly Chi Chi, which are all these ones here. I've got a lot of the Astralis ones, which the Velour Lips, which are really drying. Like, as I'm sure you guys know, there's so much stuff on YouTube about them, but they're not too good. Like, good for the price, but so much better out there. I've got what's this uh, oh this is the one that came with Chloe Morello's little kit um, I've got a couple of savvy lip stains I've got some of the color drama sticks uh, some lip glosses over here this is the Revlon color burst lip lacquers uh, I've got a whole bunch of Revlon what were these even called lip butters yeah, the Revlon Lip Butters, they were so overrated, guys, and I got so many of them. Like, I have all those there, and then I swear I have other Lip Butters. Where are they? Oh, they're there. There's a couple in there, a few more scattered, but, oh, biggest waste of money, honestly. And then with my lip liners, I've just got a whole bunch of different brands. I'll just lay them out and show you quickly. Okay, so I've got some, oh, there are a couple of Chi Chi lipsticks. A few of them actually. Uh, I've got some Astralis. Who's this? Who the heck is that? I don't even know where that's from, guys. Uh, Essence, L'Oreal, more Essence. Um, that's a cheaper brand from Kmart, I'm pretty sure. Napoleon Purtis. Uh, who's this? That's a MAC one. Revlon. No idea who that is. Uh, random, random, more essence, uh, love, now that's a Kmart brand, I'm pretty sure. Is this actually pigmented? I'm going to try it out. Whoa, it's actually really pigmented, I just swatched it there. You can't really see it in this shocking light, but it's there, and pretty, pretty decent colour payoff. And then, this is an eyebrow thing. <laughs> And then I've got a whole bunch of these, like these ones that you see here. I used to work at a chemist and like they used to get rid of cosmetics all the time. So these ones I got for, as freebies. You can see they've like crossed off the barcode so they weren't to be sold anymore. That's all I really have time for guys because my storage is so full. I really should have planned this a bit better before I filmed it. That's pretty much all of my lipsticks though. Like I did get through quite a bit. I love lipstick so much. This is probably my favorite drawer to look at in my whole collection. And yeah, I really do not need any more lipsticks ever again. But we all know I'm going to keep buying them, hey. What's this one? Oh, see, this is the cheap Kmart brand. Let's see how this one is. See, this is dodgy AF. That's it just on my thing. I mean, it's not bad. It's like very balmy and glossy. Like if you put a lip balm under it and maybe a liquid lipstick and you just want this as like a little sheen on top it wouldn't be bad okay i will see you guys in my next video bye